It's that time, everyone. Welcome to the Carolyn's Challenge. Is it a cocktail? Uh-huh. Is it a dessert? Eh. This is executive chef Krista Sheen at Crush Restaurant in downtown Toronto. And I'm, oh I, I'm Kevin. And, uh, and, and, and no, nope, nope, forget Kevin about it. Forget about it. Forget. No, nobody important. We are using some fine Irish cream, Carolyn's, and we are making cocktails and desserts. I do my bread and butter pudding every Thanksgiving, so this is a staple. So I have my raisins soaked in rum. Havana, Havana Club, Club. very nice, the reserve. And then I'm gonna crap my eggs. We're gonna have one yolk, two whole eggs. While you do that, I'm gonna just slice my raisins. Three chilled glass, three raisins, on the edge is a bit of a garnish. I like to see well, what anyway, I'm Well, anyway, so I have some sugar here that I'm just gonna mix into my eggs. How are those raisins going there, Kevin? Wonderful, yeah? wonderful. Looks pretty difficult over there. In a pot, we're gonna put some cream. We're also gonna put some milk. This would be the secret ingredient. How this, much? Well, I was saying about a quarter cup. I have these mini brioche loaves, but you can use white bread. Then we're gonna take a little bit of butter, because it is bread and butter. Whisk in my hot cream mixture into my eggs. A little, a little schnapps. Butter ripple schnapps. Just to give it a little bit of kick. I'm gonna start with a big ounce of our Carolyn's Irish Creek. We're gonna extend it with the Jameson's Irish Whiskey. We're gonna do about a half. Then we're gonna go three quarters of the butter ripple, okay? And that, you're gonna get texture, and you're gonna get some sweetness in there, and they're all going to meld together beautifully. We can just give it a gentle, loving, Gentle. Get to know you. How can I it be it. any more beautiful than that? Look at that. And then we're just going to stick this in a 350 degree oven in a bain marie, which is a water bath. And, and uh, about 45 minutes until it's set. And I'm just going to make a quick sauce. I'm just going to take some butter, cream, equal amount, and maybe a little bit of sugar. We're going to be adding the uh, Carolyn's Irish cream. And we're basically going to bring it to a boil, reduce it by half, and then okay. pour it over top. That's been brought up to a boil. And you just pour it over. We're gonna add some fresh nutmeg to the cornucopia. Is it a cocktail? Is it a dessert? I'm not sure. You I decide. think mine will win though. CC Penaloza, the glow and mail. You write about uh, celebrities and celebrity yeah. spotting and all that good stuff. Obviously, that's why you're here today, because we are celebrity chefs. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Tell us how it works and which, not which one's better, but which one just hmm. represents hmm. a little yeah. bit more than the other. It's very robust. Very dairy forward. It's that sort of uh, dessert that you drink. I'm going to cover it's, your tap on this one. I, I, <laughs> you don't have to pay. Get to the dessert, please, because okay. it is good too. It's like Ben Affleck and Matt Damon. I'm not really sure one of them is really tall and it's like, handsome, and the other one is like, like a ben slow learner. Cornucopia of goodness. They, they shared it, didn't they? <laughs> they did. They did. Okay. Share. They did okay. Share. Yeah, Hang on. Ladies fun. and gentlemen, Glow and Mel, CC Penaloza declares well this round of the Carolyn's Challenge <laughs> using your fabulous Irish cream a draw. A tie. Well done, well done. Bravo. To Bravo. Ben Affleck and Matt Damon. Come down here. You guys get yours on the house.